Shanghai show. And uh, i got to be honest with you, my favorite Chinese supermarket just got taken over by a Tesco. And I thought, uh, well, since it was taken over, I might as well take in a camera to see that uh, globalism personified. Here we go, up the stairs. Um, shockingly, not a crowd, which is unusual because, uh, well, it, it is Shanghai. And there are about 20 million people. Uh, to the right, you always have the, uh, I guess what's a form of tea? Uh, I'm sure there's a, a word for it, but uh, Vivian's out of the country, being a fashion uh, designer, so I, I, I can't ask. Um, no nice greeter, like we usually have at Walmart, animated conversation. To the right, what you have is kind of a new thing. These are real DVDs selling for about three US dollars. Um, to the left, the basics, vinegar, tea, beer, rice, moon pies, um, pampers if you have too much of uh, said beer. Uh, also on the right, what you're gonna see is uh, house slippers to go with those pajamas, which are basically uh, the outfit here in Shanghai. We're gonna do a show about the, uh, the the PJs here. Coming up, more shoes. See, it sells something for five kwai, which is about 60 cents. Not a bad deal. Here we go, through the fresh food, uh, which might be a bit of a stretch, um, but the fresh food and, of course, fish on ice. Um, I'm sorry, this isn't the fish on ice. This is uh, the beef on ice, as well as the chicken breast on ice, as well as the drumsticks on ice. What else we have here? Really, really cheap produce. Uh, actually, if you are moving here, I mean, you can get three chicken breasts for about maybe 10 kwai, which is about $1.25. So um, make sure you have a, a good kitchen. Bit of jellyfish there. Always eating the jellyfish. More fish, more fish. Close up of the fish. It's me being arty. Uh, those strange little white things with eyes in them that I, I don't understand how people eat. We've got eel. Uh, what do we have on the left? Ooh, it's a uh, bit of fish. And then the Shanghai delicacy, the crabs, which um, are becoming uh, in season. Uh, more jellyfish. Quite tasty, actually. And uh, what else do we have here? Oh, this is going to be the hot pot aisle. Uh, I think it's Holgua, I believe is I don't, the pronunciation might be wet. Basically, it's, you know, when you have the boiling pot of oil. Uh, this is for when you eat it at home. You've got uh, the fish balls. You've got um, your fake crab. You've got your, uh, what else do you have? Your your, your pre-cut uh, mutton. So uh, if the wintertime comes, it's definitely something to uh, keep in stock. And you can buy yourself one of those little hot pot makers for uh, maybe about five or six US dollars. Fried chicken. They love the fried chicken here. We've got uh, KFC and we've got... Uh, Colonel Sanders, what is it, Kenny Rogers Roasters, and a bit of bread on the left, um, pet products, more pet products, quintessential, we've got three, oh, balsa, there, no sell for about a quai each, good morning snack there, uh, rice, and rice, and more rice, and we're here on the liquor. Oh, you just you just missed the. Uh, they've got Boddingtons now, actually, in uh, Shanghai supermarkets. But more importantly, the Boddingtons they've got PBR. How about that? Made especially for China. I don't know if you can see the Chinese writing down there. Uh, pretty good stock of wines. A lot of them come from. Uh, oh, those aren't though. Those are the, the, the like Chinese brandy and stuff. But over here, you get a lot of wines coming in from uh, Australia, New Zealand. Um, and of course, to the right, you have by Joe. There's one for 50 US cents. There's one in a water bottle for about 30 US cents. Looks like a water bottle. Fun trick to play on people the morning after. Uh, and even cheaper, about uh, 25 cents. That entire bottle is enough for you and a friend. Trust me on that. More selection of wines. Shanghai actually getting more and more educated uh, on wines here, which is good. And of course, the one aisle of what's being referred to as imported goods, which is uh, basically soup and uh, stuff that Tesco probably can't sell in England. So look for dental floss. Um, what else do we have here? It's kind of weird, this imported aisle, to be honest, because if you just look at the aisle next to it, they probably have the Chinese version, which is just as good. So things like tuna, things like honey, um, you know, obviously uh, Orville Redenbacher's. Oh, I would suggest buying your, um, forever sure. I would suggest buying your popcorn, uh, the Tabasco is huge also, by the way, but I would suggest buying your popcorn here at the supermarket instead of on the street because for some reason, Chinese think salt on popcorn is disgusting. Sugar is the only way you should eat it. So, uh, just a, a, a word of warning there. What else do we have? We have the, uh, ooh, the Lipton girl. Mm hmm. And, um, what else is, oops, sorry about that. Um, the cereal aisle. 
pretty much it. Not uh, not as Chinese as it was before it got taken over by the corporate monster uh, Tesco, but uh, a little bit more organized. And um, that's really about it. This is where you go and pay. And that's it. It's the Shanghai show, which we've left the camera running too long. There it is. Shanghai show. Be back tomorrow.